career be playing coaching what is one moment that just sticks out to you out of all the moments you have had well I kind of divide my career in those two categories the coaching and the playing and there was nothing better than playing and for me I'm gonna have to uh, say playing wise was in 1985 for the Indian Wells event that was played at, in La Quinta at the time the pilot pen I know in my mind, you know, winning it was a very big deal, but the award ceremony with Charlie Passarell put together kind of a, um, a group of champions, Ellie Vines, uh, Alice Marble, Pancho Gonzalez, Jack Kramer, and Tony Traber. And these guys, like icons to me, and they kind of paved the way for, you know, professional tennis, and where everyone should be very appreciative. I, those were like part of some of my idols. So uh, it was a very special moment for me. Very nice. And then I guess if you have to give one, the most important piece of advice you could give, even as a coach, to the, new, to the younger guys on tour right now, what would that piece of advice be? Well, for me, I'm not you know too old, I don't think. I'm, I'm 60 years old. And, and I really feel that I was raised a little bit more on the military side. Uh, my dad, we had a lot of kids in our family. Um, we had eight kids in our family. Wow. And so everything was a work ethic. And I think that's been lost a little bit in our game. And uh, that's why we see a guy like Roger Federer, almost 36 years old, dominating this game. Uh, we, I'd, I'd like to see some of the young kids step up to the plate, so to speak. And uh, I think that's what it's going to take. Works for me. Thank you for your time. You're welcome. I appreciate it.